Companies Act with its variations is a stock short title used for legislation in Botswana, Hong Kong, India, Malaysia, New Zealand, South Africa and the United Kingdom in relation to company law. The bill for an act with this short title will usually have been known as a company's bill during its passage through Parliament. Companies Acts may be a generic name either for legislation bearing that short title or for all legislation which relates to company law. List Botswana The Companies Act 2007 Topic India The Companies Act 1913 The Companies Act 1956 The Companies Act 2013 Topic Malaysia The Companies Act 1965 Topic New Zealand Companies Act 1993 Originally Joint Stock Companies Act 1860 Topic Singapore The Companies Act twenty fourteen Topic Brunei The Companies Act nineteen eighty four Topic South Africa The Companies Act, 1973 The Companies Act, 2008 United Kingdom The Royal Exchange and London Assurance Corporation Act 1719 or Bubble Act The Trading Companies Act 1834 The Chartered Companies Act 1837 7 Will 4 and 1 Vict C73 the Joint Stock Companies Act 1844 7 and 8 Vict C 110 The Companies Clauses Consolidation Act 1845 8 and 9 Vict C 16 The Limited Liability Act 1855 18 and 19 Vict C 133 the Joint Stock Companies Act 1856 19 and 20 Vict C 47 The Companies Act 1862 25 and 26 Vict C 89 The Companies Seals Act 1864 27 and 28 Vict C 19 the Companies Clauses Act 1863 26 and 27 Vict C 118 The Railway Companies Act 1867 30 and 31 Vict C 127 The Companies Act 1867 30 and 31 Vict C 131 the Companies Clauses Act 1869 32 and 33 Vict C 48 The Joint Stock Companies Arrangement Act 1870 33 and 34 Vict C 104 The Companies Act 1877 40 and 41 Vict C 26 the Companies Act 1879 42 and 43 Vict C 76 The Companies Act 1880 43 Vict C 19 
The Companies Colonial Registers Act 1883 46 and 47 Vict C30 the Chartered Companies Act 1884 47 and 48 Vict C56 The Companies Act 1886 49 and 50 Vict C23 The Companies Clauses Consolidation Act 1888 51 and 52 Vict C48 the Companies Clauses Consolidation Act 1889 52 and 53 Vict C37 The Companies Memorandum of Association Act 1890 53 and 54 Vict C62 The Companies Winding Up Act 1890 53 and 54 Vict C63 the Directors Liability Act 1890 53 and 54 Vict C64 The Companies Winding Up Act 1893 56 and 57 Vict C58 The Life Assurance Companies Payment into Court Act 1896 59 and 60 Vict C8 the Companies Act 1907 7 EDW 7 C50 The Companies Consolidation Act 1908 The Railway Companies Accounts and Returns Act 1911 1 and 2 G05 C34 The Statutory Companies Redeemable Stock Act 1915 5 and 6 G05 C44 the Companies Act 1928 The Companies Act 1929 19 and 20 G05 C23 The Companies Act 1947 10 and 11 G06 C47 The Companies Act 1948 11 and 12 G06 C38 the Insurance Companies Act 1958, 6 and 7 Elise 2 C72, repealed. The Companies Act 1967, C81, repealed. The Insurance Companies Amendment Act 1973, C58. The Insurance Companies Act 1974 C49 repealed the Companies Act 1976 C69 repealed the Insurance Companies Act 1980 C25 the Insurance Companies Act 1981 C31 repealed the Insurance Companies Act 1982 C50 repealed the Companies Act 1985 C6 The Companies Consolidation Consequential Provisions Act 1985 C9 The Companies Act 1989 C40 the Statutory Water Companies Act 1991 C58 The Insurance Companies Reserves Act 1995 C29 repealed The Companies Audit Investigations and Community Enterprise Act 2004 C27 the Companies Act 2006 C46 The Companies Acts 1862 to 1893 is the collective title of the Companies Act 1862 the Companies Seals Act 1864 the Companies Act 1867 the Joint Stock Companies Arrangement Act 1870 the Companies Act 1877 the Companies Act 1870 the Companies Act 1880, the Companies Colonial Registers Act 1883, the Companies Act 1886, the Companies Memorandum of Association Act 1890, the Companies Winding Up Act 1890, the Directors Liability Act 1890, and the Companies Winding Up Act 1893, the Companies Acts 1948 to 19. 
1976 was the collective title of the Companies Act 1948, Parts 1 and 3 of the Companies Act 1967, the Companies Floating Charges and Receivers Scotland Act 1972, Section 9 of the European Communities Act 1972, Sections 1 to 4 of the Stock Exchange Completion of Bargains Act 1976, Section 9 of the Insolvency Act 1976, and the Companies Act 1976. The Companies Acts 1948–1980 was the collective title of the Companies Act 1948, Parts 1 and 3 of the Companies Act 1967, the Companies Floating Charges and Receivers Scotland Act 1972, Section 9 of the European Communities Act 1972, Sections 1–4 of the Stock Exchange Completion of Bargain Act 1976, Section 9 of the Insolvency Act 1976, the Companies Act 1976, and the Companies Act 1980, the Companies Clauses Acts 1845–1889 is the collective title of the Companies Clauses Consolidation Act 1845, the Companies Clauses Act 1863, the Companies Clauses Act 1869, the Companies Clauses Consolidation Act 1888 and the Companies Clauses Consolidation Act 1889. The Life Assurance Companies Acts 1870–1872 was the collective title of the following Acts, the Life Assurance Companies Act 1870 33 and 34 Vict C61. The Life Assurance Companies Act 1871 34 and 34 Vict C58 The Life Assurance Companies Act 1872 35 and 36 Vict C41 Topic Scotland The Companies Clauses Consolidation Scotland Act 1845 8 and 9 Vict C17 the Railway Companies Scotland Act 1867 30 and 31 Vict C 126 The Companies Floating Charges Scotland Act 1961 9 and 10 Elise 2 C 46 Topic Northern Ireland the Companies Act Northern Ireland 1960 C22 NE The Insurance Companies Northern Ireland Act 1968 C6 NE The Open Ended Investment Companies Act Northern Ireland 2002 C13 Companies Order a number of orders in council with this title or some variation on it have been passed. The change in nomenclature is due to the demise of the Parliament of Northern Ireland and the imposition of direct rule. These orders are considered to be primary legislation. The Companies Northern Ireland Order 1986 SI 1986 NI6 The Companies Consolidation Consequential Provisions Northern Ireland Order 1986 SI 1986 NI9 the Companies Northern Ireland Order 1989 SI 1989/2404 NI 18 The Companies Northern Ireland Order 1990 SI 1995/193 NI 5 the Companies Number no. Two Northern Ireland Order 1990 SI 1990 1504 NI10. 
the company's audit, investigations and community enterprise Northern Ireland Order 2005 SI 2005 1967 NI 17 Topic See also List of short titles